Hi, and welcome to Tip Talk. I'm Hadass, and in this episode, I'd like to talk to you about linkable clicks. Clickable links. Let's go. In this episode, I'd like to show you how easy it is to add a clickable link to your designs. Some things I want you to know in advance. A link will be clickable only in the following file types. PDF, presentation, and a website. You can turn any object to be clickable. It could be an element, a photo, a background, a video, a sticker, you name it. Now let's see how simple it is. Let's say, for example, I want this little text box here that says tickets available at reallygreatsite.com to be my clickable link. All I have to do is go up here to this link feature, click on that, and type in the URL. I recommend you copy and paste the exact URL from your website or anywhere else you want to direct people to so you don't accidentally miss a symbol or a note while typing. This can happen. Once you do that, you click on apply. Now, how do people know that this is clickable? The best way to be is to add some kind of call to action. It can either be by typing manually, click here for example, or you can go to elements and search for the word click and then you get a bunch of icons and stickers that you can add to your design. For example, I'll do this. And this can draw my audience's attention to this clickable link. Another thing I can do is perhaps take this clickable link, I'll copy that, and instead of having this text box, I can delete it. I can add this button, click here, and maybe edit it a little bit so it can pop out. I'll change the colors just to make it more vibrant. And then I can have this button also be clickable. I will just go back to the link, paste my URL, click on apply, and that's it. People that will click on this button or on this text box will be redirected to my website. Once you download and share your design as a PDF, a presentation, or a website, you're good to go. That's it. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Share with us your thoughts about clickable links, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Wow, thank you, Adas, for these precious tips. And thank you for watching this video until the end. I have two playlists right here for those of you who want to go a bit deeper and keep learning. This one right here is a collection of step-by-step -step Canva tutorials. And this one gathers all of our Canva Space webinar recordings where Canva experts teach about all sorts of topics.